I may have to go into the scrap metal business. Big shout out to Thomas. He gave me this Craftsman. I think it's a 21 horse. This Husky is a 25 horse. And this Craftsman, I'm trying to remember, maybe a 19 horse? Anyway, and a whole bunch of other stuff came with it. Car batteries, stainless tank, a little welder, a Honda engine that threw a rod. There's a chainsaw in the bucket, exhaust parts, an old drill. Anyway, I want to get these three mowers unloaded, see what they're going to do. Might be there might be a uh, zombie engine in here, or a oppie replacement on the outboard. And the hood on it, the grill that reminds me of that old 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 fish on SpongeBob. See the resemblance? Anyway, I need an engine for my uh, homemade boat motor. The one I have now is got an oppie, and the oil's leaking out of the bottom of it. This might be that engine, 19 horse. I don't really know. Let's see how it mows first, then we'll decide about that. I also need an engine for my zombie mower. This might be the engine for it too. Anyway, uh, there's gas in the tank. About this much gas, but I think it's old gas. Watch this. So if we drain out that old gas, clean the carburetor, it should be running. So I just took a bit of a shortcut. I drained the gas out of the tank. I drained the gas out of the bowl. I put some new gas in. Let's see what happens. It is the next day. I'm right here with the Craftsman. I decided to go ahead and clean the carburetor. It ran last night, but pretty crappy. And on the inside, it looks pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and put it back together, see if we can get it to run. So the yard is terribly muddy last night. I came out last night. I put the engine cowling back on, and this thing runs now. Here, let me show you. I can show you a clip from last night. And it even mows. Problem is, the front tires are flat and it does not want to steer. I think about putting these junk tires on it and going back and forth in a straight line. Then I'm thinking of pulling this engine off and putting it either on the zombie machine or homemade boat motor number, what is that, number six, number five? Maybe you should vote right here. This engine on the zombie mower or build another homemade boat motor. I need your votes. Anyway, I'm gonna try to get it running. I just took the ratchet strap, rubbed around this tire, aired it up. The other tire, it was wobbling all over the place. Like the wheels missing a bushing. And it's not been greased since this thing was new. I don't even know if they greased it at the factory. So I've got this other wheel I'm going to stick on there. It's already got air in it. I'll put a little grease on the axle. All four tires are now aired up. Let's do that test drive. Whoops.
didn't make it. I ran out of gas, but we got the zero turn on the way. All right, we're gonna see if the Red Craftsman can pull out the Red Craftsman. Here goes. And there it is, back home again. Don't forget to like it, especially if you liked it.